This is a custom-built PC built by iBuy Power, and the motherboard on this custom-built PC is dead and need to be replaced. This is the old dead motherboard, and I already installed the new motherboard. Right now, I'm in the process of transferring all the parts from the old motherboard to dead motherboard to the new motherboard, like the CPU, memory, and the solid state drive. But there is one thing that I noticed. You see right here, this one right here, and this one right here. I thought this old motherboard have two solid state drive installed on the board, but no, I was wrong. When I open this, this is empty. There's nothing in here. And the thermal pad still not used. I don't know why I buy power didn't install the solid state drive on this port right here with a thermal pad, but instead they install it right here, which is kind of strange. And I don't think they do a good job installing the solid state drive to the correct or appropriate slot. And that's how I installed the solid state drive. 